Good morning everyone, this is Liza Claire Lumot. I am from Balihihan Bohol. I am applying for both junior and senior high school level at San Roque National High School. So let's start my demonstration now. Yes, good morning class. So please all stand for the prayer. Amen. So good morning once again. So before you take your seat, please pick up some pieces of paper under your chairs. Thank you. So monitor, please check the attendance. Oh, very good. You have perfect attendance. Give it up, class. All right. So now let's check your assignment. So you are assigned to bring all the ingredients that we need for today. Did you bring it, class? Okay, that's perfect. So today, before we start our lesson, let's have a take a review of what we did last meeting. Yes, Jade. All right, very good. Very well said, Jade. We discussed all about different types of a brand. So any classification, any clarification? Okay, if there's not, let's now move on to our next topic. So, but before that, let us have a sort of activity. So, I have here a food items. So, please observe on it. So, what kind of food is this? Yes, can. A sandwich. Very good. So, what can you say about the sandwich? Oh, it looks delicious. Yes. And what are the ingredients that you can see in the sandwich? Yes. There are lots of ingredients in it. So based on this, may I know what they think are our lesson for this morning? Okay, very good. So we will tackle all about the basic components of a sandwich. So the last sandwich class. Okay, that's great. All right, so a sandwich, it's a very common for us. So before we will go to our discussion, let's have a sort of activity, okay? So I have here an ingredients. This will, all you need to do is you will be grouped into three and then identify whether these are in the structure or a base or this will be in the filling and this or this under the moistening agent. So you will group into three groups. So group count one, two, and three. So group number one there, two here, and three at the back. Okay. So I'll just give you two minutes to do this. Okay? Alright. One minute left. Okay, time's up. So, first presenter, group number one. Yes? Oh, very good. So, another group two. Okay, still good job. Group and three. Okay, that's perfect. So, before that, what can you say about our activity? Yes, you see a lot of ingredients in it. All right. And in this lesson, let's have your objectives. So first one, you need to identify the three basic components of a sandwich, prepare the sandwich, and share the importance of these components of a sandwich. Okay? So I am too fast. Okay, so please follow. Let's define what is a sandwich. So a sandwich is a food item with two or more slices of breads with filling between them and it is eaten as a light meal. So we serve, actually, ser uh, sandwich is served during snacks because this is only a light for a light meal. So again, Sandwich has three basic components. This first one, we have structure or base, which is a part upon which our 
ingredients or things and consists of some form of bread, a dough, a dough products that is whole or sliced. So, structure and base is commonly used as uh, bread. So, these breads have different types. So, there are four types of bread. First one, yes, bread. Second, buns and rolls. Flat bread and wheat breads. So, next we have the moistening agent. So, moistening agents are meant to bind the sandwich and providing to improve the both flavor and texture of a sandwich. Examples are mayonnaise, cheese, batter, sandwich spread, and salad dressing. Okay? Do you understand? Okay. So next we have the fillings. So fillings are consist of one or more ingredients that are layered or folded within the structure and to form a sandwich and it is serves also as the heart of the sandwich. So that's all about the sandwich, components of the sandwich. Any questions or clarification? Okay, if there's none, so I will demonstrate how to make that sandwich. So please take a look at it. So we have the bread. Here's the bread. And we have the spread. And we have the filling. So first one, we need to put the bread with the spread. Okay. And next one, we need to put the filling. And cover or with the bread again. So it's very simple. It's easy to make. So do you understand how to make the sandwich? Okay, very good. So now it's your turn to get your ingredients and where your PP is. So I'll just give you three minutes to do this. Okay, is it fine? Okay, uh, just five minutes. All right. For doing that activity, let's have your criteria or the rubrics for your activity. So first one, correct procedures and complete ingredients, 50 points. Next, content is artistically, creatively done. And observe safety procedures with 15 and 15 points and maintain cleanliness and orderliness it's 20 points all in all it's total of 100 points okay so again make your own simple sandwich using the three basic components okay time start now five minutes left Okay, time's up, class. So present your output in the presentation table. Okay, thank you. So what have you learned in this uh, lesson? Yes. Okay, do so you learn how to make your own sandwich? Okay, why it is important that you need to know the basic components of the sandwich? Okay, very good. So we need to know how to make this sandwich and also we need to know the common uh, components in it for us to make or to prepare a sandwich which are helpful, um, delicious and artistically done sandwich. Most especially nowadays it's a uh, time of pandemic we run out of time so we need to have a uh, easy uh, picky foods okay so any questions or clarification all right if there's not uh, let us uh, please copy your assignment your assignment will be uh, research on what are the two types of sandwich and give an example of it okay all right so please all stand for the closing prayer amen so goodbye class Thank you for listening.